Celebrate 75 years of joy with this new edition featuring more than 4,000 recipes classic and new. Welcome to a whole new generation of joy. It seems that all our holiday memories are accompanied by the aroma of turkey just out of the oven. But a lot of people have carving anxiety. Now, armed with your joy of cooking and a trusty carving knife, you'll serve up perfect juicy slices of turkey every time. It's important to always allow any whole roasted poultry to rest outside the oven before you start carving. While the bird is resting though, don't tent with foil, the skin will get soggy. Start with the legs, holding the turkey steady. You can also use a large fork. Cut through the skin where the leg meets the breast. Now, push the leg away from the body until the leg pulls free. Take your knife and separate the drumstick and thigh at the joint. If you're good with a knife, you can cut neat slices from the drumstick or just leave whole. We're ready to remove the wings. Pry the wing away from the body until you see the joint and slice through with your knife. There are a couple different ways to carve a turkey breast. See which one you prefer. One method is to cut long, thin slices from one end to the other, parallel to the breastbone. This is certainly more traditional, but the slices can dry out when they're this thin. You might prefer this way. Remove the entire breast and move it to your cutting board. Now, with the skin side facing up, make thicker slices. Whichever way you decide works best for you, it's always a good idea to carve only one breast at a time. You've worked hard to cook the perfect turkey, so make sure it's still warm when it gets to the table. The holidays can be a little stressful, so let Joy of Cooking be your guide to worry-free carving guaranteed to make your turkey look as delicious as it tastes. Here's wishing you good food, good friends, and a joyful holiday season.